Hello friends, today we will see what addition billing software, what addition billing software particularly using for uh, you know uh, Gulf countries, foreign countries and all, especially in um, Saudi Arabia there is a big changes is there in uh, you know from the government side, there is a QR code implementation, credit note, debit note, everything we will see in this uh, video. So from the even including barcode generation I will show you so that it will be very clear for you. I will add product everything I will show you one by one. So this is the software the VAT edition billing software this software name is Raintech POS. Raintech POS VAT edition software. Let's see how the software is working and how the software is looks like everything we will see. So this is the interface the beautiful interface uh, in a very simple way you can add product in two ways like one by one product add or excel sheet bulk upload. This excel sheet bulk upload option is over here and in the left side you can see excel sheet uh, bulk upload. The products, uh, this there is a template is there, uh, here you can see the download the template. Just click on download template and you can save this template somewhere in the PC, in the desktop. I just save it, successfully saved. And in that template we can fill the you know our information like uh, where is that uh, file? Here is the file, see this is the one. Yani, uh, we will, uh, for example, we can uh, fill the product name over here, for example, in, in English or Arabic, which are the language you are suitable, you can fill it over here. Just I will put shampoo and uh, sabun and uh, sugar, etc. Yani, yani mango. Example, some products I added and I put category, subcategory ID 1. And you can create multiple subcategories over here in the software. HSN code, your tax code is there. You can fill it or uh, you can mention the zero as well. No issues. And uh, purchase price, for example, 25 real. This is 30 real purchase price. Excel sheet, very simple way like that. Uh, you can uh, add it like that. Sale price also you can like uh, mentioned over here. 35, 45 like that. The selling price you can mention over here. And thousands of products you can add like that. Discount is there, otherwise just put zero. And what percentage I am putting? 15 percentage, 15 percentage like that. Uh, like that. Sus is there uh, or zero, zero, zero. Wholesale price, for example, uh, in bit less than the, you know, retail price like uh, 30 rupees. Yani, for, for example, 30 rupees or uh, yani 35 rupees. Like this wholesale price if you have wholesale price mention otherwise make it zero uh, any opening stock like uh, a thousand pieces every each product you have thousand pieces yeah kg or something like that you can mention even uh, opening stock here here i put one uh, you know, one triple zero one yeah one triple zero two like that continuous barcode you can generate or if any product have uh, any barcode by the product itself you can mention that one also any pieces uh, I mentioned pieces I mentioned everywhere pieces and uh, PCS or numbers or kg whatever unit unit mentioned you can mention PCS like that conversion value I make it one any if any unit conversion or something like that Minimum stock, uh, yani this is a, rem a remainder option, uh, for example, if I mentioned two pieces over here, when it reaches, uh, you, you are selling the product from the 100 piece or 1000 piece, uh, you sell out, sold out, when it is reached to two pieces, software will give you alert, like this one I make it 50, yeah, 60, yeah, whatever it is, like make it much bigger, yani 60, yeah, 80, yeah, 90, 90, something like that. So this is the very simple step you need to uh, yani, uh, practice. Uh, you can prepare the you know Excel sheet like you know thousands of products you can prepare like that and you can upload it to the software. I just uh, save the file over here in the top. In the top you can see this one saved and close it. Now let's go again to our uh, billing software. Uh, go to import export products, products and uh, click on the products. And here now we go to import uh, button over here. This is the one. Import. Click on the products uh, in the desktop, the uh, Excel sheet which we prepared. All product came here very fast. Yani. Uh, just to save it. Like that. Just to save it. Successfully saved. Everything is okay. Yani. Perfect. 
and uh, next step is that directly you can create invoice or you can create some barcodes or you can scan and pre prepare the invoice i will show you like that way in the in the in the for creating the barcode for your products you can uh, go there like uh, you know here in the barcode section go to barcode section generate barcodes and see all product it will show over here you can search some products for example mango for example like that particularly one product you want to search you can search it or you can you know reset click on reset all the products will come over there so i will click you know the number of copies there you can create uh, change the number of copy over here how many pieces you need to create barcode like that this is 10 pieces if you need this is also 10 pieces you need like that you can uh, change the quantity and uh, click on tick button over here on the left side like that and there is so many templates is there on the right side like th like that this is the one templates uh, select any templates which you like yani there is uh, i create one template over here to one uh, two by one inch dual yani one sticker two time yani two uh, barcode will come it will come over here let's see this one you can see no i will select the printer over here this is a tsc 244 printer and uh, i just print it i will show you let's see the print is coming over here a beautiful way it's coming it's a beautiful way see you can cut it like that sorry see it's a beautiful way the barcode is uh, created and uh, you can see over here this is the one see now you can see over here this is beautiful it is created like that now the barcode is ready with us now let's see how we can create the invoice so in order to that i will use this uh, tabletop scanner this is a scanner we will scan this one one by one and we will take the invoice so for that there is an option is called to see in this uh, interface right side uh, f1 in the keyboard you press f1 so there is a very very important thing is that there is you know uh, simplified tax invoice and tax invoice both are there so let's see uh, what is simplified simplified means b2c click on that same same like counter c any b to c so, and uh, i click on uh, you know click over here see this one and uh, i just remove like that see i click like, so automatically product will come down any see like that see like that so easiest way you can scan it you know, all this product you will stick on your uh, you know of course in your products all sorry all these barcodes of course you will stick in your products like that or you can scan it one by one or uh, like that see so this is the way you can scan it so this one quantity i make it three of course sometimes it is three so the quantity same barcode is came actually shampoo yeah this is the mango mango is coming yeah mango already came yeah shampoo barcode not came shampoo i'll scan it this is shampoo yeah see so like that you can scan your barcode and uh, let's uh, click on uh, f2 f12 button and here in the keyboard f12 and in the f2 and the keyboard f2 so enter so there is a simplified tax invoice is there you can see over here this is a simplified tax invoice now let's scan it with our uh, qr code uh, we have qr code from uh, you know from the uh, from the i think from the saudi government they released this one let me see this one let me show you this one this is the one this is the one this is the qr code now you can see this qr code qr code yes where it is scan it now you can see yes you know it came over there and it's properly working any there is no issues so let's go to our uh, any print, print you can, if you want to print you click over here select uh, this printer and click over there let's it uh, print should come yani we will not wait for uh, coming printer print because uh, we will go to the next step over here and uh, what is the next step the tax invoice or let's wait two minutes let's see and uh, after that we will go so beautiful way the invoices came over here see this is the invoice you can see over here all this one is came very clearly see like that this is a simplified tax invoice 
and let's see how the tax invoice so for selecting the tax invoice what we need to do remove this uh, counter selection yani b2c option remove it select any yani customer over here select any customer your uh, customer yani click here on barcode where is our barcode yes show any product over there this is all you yani click together yes this one product i added and one more product i will scan it for you yes like that yani i click i don't use uh, mouse i click on uh, f12 and i click on f2 uh, here the button is uh, f2 the key keyboard shortcut is very very important in the you know sales now you see now you see change already the uh, the template before you look like different template for the simplified tax invoice and now you see the different template let me print out it this one like that like that print it let's the print is coming and uh, let's see how it looks like and of course we will scan it this qr code this qr code let me scan it i will uh, use my qr code scanner like that this is the scanner like that let me scan it in front of you yes is there properly it is there and uh, i will show you the physical invoice how it is the this is the new one this is the new one you can see over here the beautiful template this is as per satka you know rules and regulation article uh, is uh, you know compact you know, there is a, some uh, there is one article is there as per the article we have uh, incorporated and this is the simplified tax invoice first time it is came see now we you make uh, we make uh, yani two sales now let's see the credit note close it over there yeah keep it over here yes now close it now this here in the top you can see this tax invoice here this is tax invoice in the top let me talk uh, and this is in the top you can see it is tax invoice let me mark it and i show you here it is simplified tax invoice here it is tax invoice you can see this both and uh, here you see this is simplified tax invoice now let's see how we can make credit note so we will go out from here go out from here for making the credit note here on the uh, left side you can go to transaction here the credit note credit note also let me explain to you credit note there is two credit note one is simplified one is tax both should be same right yeah different template let me see how it should work so click on this one selection so beautiful coding we have done the last one we have done the tax invoice the last one is over here this one click on that and uh, there is two products is there for example credit note i taken one item here i taken one yani yeah, sorry one from here one add and this one also if you want to return back okay add like that and uh, here this uh, credit and uh, save of course save and print see this is of course it's came tax invoice credit note and the format is same see in the arabic format everything is there you can print it if you want to print and this is the one the last one we have done then again click on new i click on this one again yani i will go to the yani simplified one simplified one like this one this, there are so many products we have added like uh, any any one product i will uh, uh, selected and add to cart and i save and yani here select the payment mode cash or credit click on save button over here in the top saved and uh, print let's see the magic see here the simplified tax uh, invoice automatically is detected here the simplified tax invoice credit note this is the technology we have both i will uh, you know scan it for you if you want like that and you scan it scan it see see it's working properly 
So this is the technology we have with the Raindeck uh, VAT condition billing software. If you have any inquiry, if you have any doubts, if you need some information or something like that, please call us 0091-8078-311-945 or 0091-860-60-93-110. Call us. We are here to help you from uh, 10 a.m. to uh, 5.30 p.m. Monday to Saturday, Indian time, Indian. We are from India, we are from Kerala, yes, basically. So if you have need any help or support or something like that, please call us. We are here to help you. Any support from us, of course, please call us. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you. Bye-bye.